Hey, time now to throw back a few quick shots here on Happy Hour. Jennifer Lamb, CEO of Exotic Tea, that's spelled E-X-O-T-I-K, and Sandra Lee of Food Network Extraordinaire, TV star host, uh, joining us back. Well, we all know uh, what this stuff is. What is it? Bubble, Bubble wrap. wrap. Uh, some young inventors are flipping the traditional use of this stuff in a competition run by the makers of Bubble Wrap. New ideas include turning it into a shock-absorbing floor for dancers and even creating wrist cushions <laughs> for people Can with carpal tunnel syndrome. And now we have a new use of oh. Bubble Wrap. Yeah, oh. there goes the mic. There That's all right. <laughs> yeah. I am going to send Rebecca home for the holidays. <laughs> Cheaper than typical. Yay. She can play football this weekend. Oh, All yeah. Right. This is a present for who? Mom and Dad or Brett? Uh, Mom and Dad. <laughs> I'm getting dizzy. Oh, man, this is a lot okay, of rap. All right, I'm cutting it. Though. Dizzy. Yeah. All right. Whoa. No yeah. All right, so what do you think? Can yeah. you, do you got any good ideas for the bubble wrap? I think you did great crazy. Yeah. Do you know how to tie a bow, sweetie? No, oh, my goodness. Yeah, we got an expert. I like it. That's beautiful. <laughs> to make it pretty. <laughs> but it's paper. You got the cheap stuff. Sandra <laughs> Lee, let's get creative. What can you come up with bubble wrap? What innovative use besides I mean, wrapping these? Be Stuffing your bases so that you don't know. fill them up all the way and then you can make something beautiful just on the top and you save a lot of money. I love that. Stuffing the bases for the bubble wrap. Okay. Um, all right. Uh, Jen? For me, I mean, I don't really have an idea per se, but I see um, some cocktails and a safety feature of some degree. <laughs> Too oh! many cocktails. Too many oh. Actually, that's, that's perfect. Sure where we In other this, like, this could be your going out at night to the bar <laughs> outfit. Yes, that's perfect. Yeah, this is a fashion <laughs> outfit. Does it hurt? Does it Wait hurt? Wait a minute. Oh, see? You, you know, and if you're obsessed with bubble wrap, you can even check this one out. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing this. Maybe it's supposed it's a to sound chain. like bubble Here. wrap. It's can you guys hear chain. it? Excellent. Constant yeah, Bubble Pound. That? That were, these guys, by the way, these, they was very nice. They rushed over these to us today from thinkgreen.com. Thinkgeek.com. I'll learn to read yeah. someday, guys. Thinkgeek.com. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This is my new dress. Can you hit us with another quick shot, Derry? All right. An English Happy woman has become one of the oldest women ever to appear in a nude calendar. At 102 years old, Miss Nora Hardwick has become Miss November. She says she's never done anything like it before and doubt she will again. <laughs> How about that? Jen, are you, will you pose nude at 102 years old? Absolutely. If you've got it, flaunt it. We know the old saying. Absolutely. <laughs> Lock on. What could you say? How about at this age? I mean, you know, uh, you know, to be determined. If the money is right, we'll talk about it. There we'll you talk go, about Rebecca. It. Whoa, what? <laughs> so if the money's right, you're going to pose nude? No. No, not happening. No. Sandra? No, I wouldn't know. No. <laughs> Would you? No. We all want well, to come on. Come on. I, I think on. we should get Cody to do one of those New York City Fire Department <laughs> calendars. Yeah, right. exactly. What month, should, what month should you be, Cody? I'm mean, just stop picking on me. Can we change topics, please? <laughs> okay, go ahead. <laughs> to the barricades. Hundreds of thousands of civil servants have joined striking transport and energy workers as France is paralyzed by a second week of strikes. It's hot in here. Teachers, postal <laughs> workers, air traffic controllers, and hospital staff are striking over planned job cuts and higher wage demands. Sandra Lee, you've been to France before? Many times. What do you think about them uh, striking there? The, I mean, the, the city, this, the country is basically paralyzed. Yeah, I think it's a very difficult time to do that because with the holidays coming, there's a lot of people traveling, especially with Christmas. It's terrible for the people in the country. It's another event for people who are visiting. Yeah. 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 You are wow. hot. We're so. hot in here. Subject now, it's please. a little warm so in so here. So it so is, guys, right? Look, right, and I have to deal with this all yeah, the time. Yeah, look at you. This one, can I tell you, you belong in Vogue in this. Yeah. <laughs> This, this pun goes out to my mom. They're telling us to rap. Rap! That I'm oh. done. Anyway, Jam guys, tap. on tap, a wine that gives back. Oh, this wine hasn't just won awards. I mean, that's the easy part. It gets 50, the company gives 50% of its profits to charity, and we will talk, right? This is show. Hope Wine. You're putting them on the show, too? I will, absolutely. They're here on I'm Happy sure Hour when we come back.